Hey you guys, welcome to your bi-weekly love reading. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising for the weeks of December 3rd through the 17th, 2018. So I have already shuffled and cut the cards. Let's go ahead and begin here. I want to thank you guys for liking, sharing, and subscribing to my channel. I ask that you all please continue to do so. Remember these are general readings, so they may or may not resonate, but hopefully they do give some clarity to you. Um... And those of you that want to reach me for a personal or private reading, always email me first. That's tamajtarot at gmail.com. And that information is in the description box below. Um, okay, so central issue, heart of the matter. We have the Four of Cups. We have the Devil. We have the Page of Wands. Three of Cups. Hanged Man, Ace of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, Seven of Wands. Okay, so I'm feeling like you guys are completely unsatisfied. Like, you are completely unsatisfied with everything that is going on around you. Um... You are maybe feeling like, what is the purpose in this life or what is the meaning? Like, I don't know why you are feeling this way. I don't know if you are in between a breakup. Um, but I'm seeing like all these emotions here in I'm seeing like you feel like maybe you wasted time has been wasted or you wasted your all your time and energy on someone. Um, I'm feeling like you're thinking about how selfish someone has been in the past. Uh, you could have been dealing with someone who was uh, very narcissistic, um, someone who was very selfish, um, or this could be your energy. Um, Maybe you're asking yourself, have I been fair? Have I been selfish? I'm getting someone who has an excessive appetite. Someone who has not been able to see their blessings here. Um, I'm, I'm seeing like waste. I don't know if you're spending your money carelessly or if you feel like you've just wasted your emotions on people who don't deserve it. Um, somebody is just kind of like you want some more emotions to throw away. And it's just like, yeah, keep pouring. I'm just going to throw that cup over too. So I don't know. It's just kind of like you are in a place where you are just kind of isolated, trying to figure things out. Uh, I feel like this devil may be more like past energy, like you were attached to someone who uh, was very greedy, selfish, codependent, and you're starting to feel used, feeling like this person, did this person ever love me? I feel like maybe this person has just been using me for sex all along. Um, is it just a physical attraction? Um I just kind of feel like you're in a space where you feel like you deserve more. Um, I feel like you're asking yourself, why do you keep getting caught up with the same type of person? Um, it's the same type of soul in a different body. You know, it's just like, why is this happening to me? Why do I keep meeting the same people over and over again? Or why don't these people satisfy me? I just get like a great sense of dissatisfaction. Like no one can make you happy. No one can please you. Uh, I feel like you're being extremely picky in regards to your relationships right now. Um, you're you're empty. There's a feeling of emptiness here going on. You're you're having a difficult time finding the right connection, or even if you're already in a relationship, um, you're having a hard time connecting with this person. Maybe you've changed, and maybe you guys just don't connect anymore. But you're, you're really bored or fed up with a relationship. You're looking for something else. Nothing. I feel like there's nothing anyone can do to, to help you. Like that's that's how you feel. Like people keep trying to offer help or assistance. 
but you're just like, you can't help me. Like, nobody can help me. I'm in a place in a, to myself right now. Um, you might be find yourself going out and wasting time uh, or trying to drown yourself in emotions through alcohol. I feel like you're trying to escape from reality right now. Um, like you're you're just you're socializing and you're dating, but there are other things on your mind. You feel very alone, very isolated. You're in a weird place right now. I don't know what is going on, what has happened, but I just feel like you're in a weird place. Um, if you are dating people, you keep telling people that you're calling them back or you're leaving people on hold and not getting back with them, um, not really having anything to say. Um, or it's like, <clears throat> if you're a guy, especially, it's like you're having like empty sex over and over again, like empty sex, empty sex. Um, you can't, it's like, you can't find nobody is meeting your needs here. You're having a hard time finding someone that you want to settle down with. Uh, things have seemed like they have been challenging, um, for the past couple of weeks, like you feel like everything's against you or like you have all this, all these obstacles or like it's an obstacle course trying to find the right person. You're like, is I feel like I'm running through hoops and circles just to find the right one. Like I need to be an athlete to, you know, to get and connect with the right person. Uh, speaking of athletes, you as a man might be an athlete that is um, on the rise and you are surrounded by nothing but uh, gold diggers uh, and people who want something for themselves. Like you're surrounded with the wrong energy. You might be in a place where you do not belong. Um, women athletes too, but you might feel like you are in a place where you don't belong. Uh, you're like, this is not my tribe. I don't know who these people are. Even though we have this this competitive nature in common, I, I'm not relating with any of these people. Um, yeah, I'm feeling like there's a lot of usury going on in your life. Nobody's real. There's a lot of phony people around. Uh, you just want something that is real here. You're like, where's the real deal here? Where's the real gold? Stop showing me all this fool's gold. You know, what's what's real? What's really going on? Oh, I forgot to start my timer. Um, but yeah, I just kind of feel like you guys are, are in a weird space. You're going through something right now and I don't know what has happened. Uh, because usually with my Aries videos, I get like a lot of, uh, you know, optimism in your relationships and in your love life. But here it looks like something's going on emotional, emotionally with you. Um, I'm seeing you, a lot of you getting drunk, a lot of you getting high. You're trying to escape. You just want to relax. You're having a hard time focusing or seeing other people um, other than the physical. I feel like you want something deeper than that. Like you're surrounded by all these beautiful and, and or handsome people, but you're desiring more. You're having a hard time figuring out what that is. You need to see something from a different perspective here. There's a need, those of you can afford it, there's a need for you to get away, go take a trip. You need to take some sort of pilgrimage. Um, I don't care if it's only to Sedona, I don't care where it is, but if you can afford it, I feel like you need to get away. Um, take a real trip, not get away with liquor and drugs, like actually go see something new, go experience something new. You might be getting prepared for that as well. Um, 
there's something there's something being aligned for you that you can't quite figure out yet that you can't quite put your finger on you i do feel like you're going to have clarity and there is something new coming into your life like there's a need for you to start thinking differently um there's going to be a, a change in your ideas your mentality i feel like you're taking on a new mentality um you're going to have to cut out a lot of people who are phony people who are not real friends i'm seeing a lot of people turning their backs on you because you have changed there's a lot of people that's going to turn their backs on you and you're going to feel isolated and alone and you're like i thought you were my friends where you weren't really my friends if you don't understand that i'm going through something then i don't need you around me so i'm feeling like you're disconnecting from a lot of people here we have the three of swords there's some sort of separation coming um I feel like you're cutting people out of your life. Uh, I feel like you're going to, you know, maybe deactivate your Facebook or your uh, Instagram. Like you're going to become very guarded. This is you kind of just cutting people out of your life because something's new is something new is happening with you. You're going through some sort of changes. Your life is changing, um, and so you are feeling like you need to protect your space. Um, and you are just kind of being cutthroat and saying, I don't need you. I don't need you. Anyone that's not on my team can get the hell out. And I'm just kind of feeling like you're going through um, getting rid of people um, that is not supportive of you and your changes and your ideas here. Uh, a lot of you are evolving. You could be going through some sort of spiritual transformation. Maybe you're just not that same person anymore. Um, maybe you're seeing an emptiness in society and you're just like, I'm just in this stupid matrix or whatever. Um, and there's a need for you to just kind of mature here. And you are getting ready to start a new phase or a new cycle in your life. Um, this is a new season for you. Um, just like nature, we go through seasons too, but ours might not be as well defined. Um, these changes might be taking place for the next um, three months or or longer. I don't know how long this cycle is going to be, but you're getting ready to uh, start a new phase in your life. Things might really start to change somewhere around December 23rd, January 19th, somewhere around that time frame. There, there could be some sort of uh, very significant changes that you're getting ready to go through. Um but yeah, I'm seeing you're going to have clarity. It's got something's going to become very clear to you. And with that clarity, you're going to be able to make some sort of final decisions here. Um, you're going to make some sort of decisions that is changing the outcome of your life or the direction of your life. Um, especially in regards to relationships and matters of the heart, but this could also be talking about things that are taking place at your job or career wise, or, uh, if you're in school dealing with your education, but for the most part, Aries, I just kind of feel like you guys are really undergoing some sort of transformation and that you don't understand it. You don't understand what's happening to you. Um, so you might be going through something spiritual. Your appetite has changed. Um, you have a different appetite now and people are trying to feed you garbage and you want knowledge. All right, so that is all the information I have for you guys. I hope that resonates. Um, don't forget to leave your comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Uh, thank you guys all for watching and many blessings to you.